So this one's probably my favorite video out of all the ones I've done. It's the most recent. Um, it's the recording studio one. Hint, hint. So yes, um, on Saturday, um, my mom and I drove to my first recording studio. So story behind it, um, I have a violin teacher, and um, I used to go to her for lessons, um, and now my brother goes. And so when I told her about my personal project, she told me that she knew a couple recording studios, and she gave me the names and like numbers, and a lot of them were down in Boulder, and um, she said that they were really pricey, but she gave me one of them, and it was like, um, it's like I have the address right here. Um, it's in Broomfield, so it's pretty close by to my house. Um, and so she said that it was pretty decent priced, and um, you know, it was it was a good uh, a good choice. So my mom called, um, you know, I, I asked her to call for me and just kind of like ask, um, talk to someone, because, like, I was really busy at school, so, um, we called, and, um, the name of the recording place is Global Sound Studio, I don't know if you can see the card, but that's the card, um, we called, and, um, the owner, um, Lydia, she's really sweet, um, she talked to my mom, and just kind of, like, you know, she, her mom kind of tried telling her about my project and what I was trying to do and stuff like that and asked if we could come by and see the place. And so Lydia said that, yeah, you know, that's fine. So finally last Saturday, um, me and my mom uh, drove over there after the gym and um, we saw the recording studio. We, we go in there and um, it's actually really nice. Um, it's the Academy of Rock. Like, I guess there's a summer camp there and a lot of my friends went to it. Um, I just never knew it was there. So, um, I mean, we met Lydia, and she's really sweet. She asked me about, like, just some questions about who I was, like my music, what I liked, what I wanted to do, if this was a long-term thing or a short-term thing. So I told her that, you know, um, I like writing music, and if there is a chance for me to, um, not a career, but, like, I mean, I think it would be really nice to, like, go and play for shows and write more songs and stuff like that. I, I would really like that. I mean, it's, um, it's my passion. So she said that um, it would totally work out. Um, I, we decided that I was going to meet with the engineer um, this Saturday, so a couple, like, five days from now. Um, meet with the engineer, and we are going to record, hopefully, three songs if I, you know, feel like I'm ready to. Um... So record three songs, uh, and it's an hour each, so hopefully that's going to happen Saturday. She also told me about um, um, a singer-songwriter, Angie Stevens, who um, is offering like a songwriting workshop and stuff um, she and she you know she has like five albums out and she's a singer songwriter and she offers like songwriting classes so Lydia asked me if I wanted to meet her and like you know maybe like um, get some classes in and um, and she could like introduce me to like a lot of like um, you know little shows I could do and really just like get me through the door of like a music career so I said that would be really great so hopefully we would um, meet Angie. I don't know if I'll meet her Saturday, but I hopefully will meet her soon. Um, and so, you know, I got um, her website, and I looked at it, and she has a lot of good music. Um, I put her in my sources, and then Lydia also printed me out a bibliography, or uh, not a bibliography, a bio. So that's Angie's bio, and she's part of my sources as well. Um, so yeah, that's been like really the most recent thing. I know that I'm going to do He Loves Me Not as one of the songs. The other two I'm not really sure about yet, but I'm going to figure that out this week. Um, when I finally finalize my songs, I'm going to like print out lyric sheets, so like lyrics, um, and then I'll make final videos. So I'll have like my songs as a final video. Like they'll be like ready and everything will be great. Um, so yeah, that's really what's going to happen. My essay, I have to start writing that. Um, I don't really feel like I can write it yet until I record, but um, I'm going to start that. And, um, I, you know, I'm still writing a lot of stuff, and uh, I really hope that I continue this project even after a personal project ends.
that's what it seems like I'm going to be doing. So I'm excited. Um, so yeah, uh, that's what's been going on so far. Um, what else, what else? I emailed my supervisor and I told her about all this, so, you know, hopefully it all works out and, um, I have to start my outline, but I do have about, um, nine sources and I'm gonna go to the library and get books and stuff, um, to like, you know, for my sources, um, and stuff like that. So I, I'm like almost there. I'm almost done. I mean, it's a relief, but also I, I really enjoy doing this project. So, you know, it's just one of those things. So I think right now I'm going to do a cover. So mm, I'll do a cover after this. I played um, Arms by Christina Perry at a little dinner we had the other day with, like, some friends. So it was pretty good. So I'm going to do a cover right now. And um, I will make videos probably one, like, every week, like, every day this week, just because it's, like, being so close and, like, there's a lot of updates and stuff. So, wish me luck on writing the songs, and uh, I have to memorize them and everything, so. Thanks for everyone who watches my videos. There's not a lot of views, but it means a lot when I go and I see at least three. So, thanks again. Wish me luck.